Welcome to the RNL Revolution Nothing Less show. This is our 118th episode. It's September 8th, 2022. My name's Andy Z. I'm the host coming to you from Los Angeles, California. Revolution, nothing less. We mean it. The people of the world need it. The planet, if it is to be able to continue to sustain humanity for future generations, needs it. Masses of humanity in their billions are suffering horribly and unnecessarily. The need is as urgent as it is necessary. Nothing less will redress the situation we face. Now watch this. Some people say, well, you're an advocate of violence. We can't have nothing to do with you. We can only deal with you if you renounce violence. Let me tell you what I am an advocate of. I am an advocate of ending oppression, exploitation, dehumanization, and degradation for people all over the world. I have spent most of my adult life actively working and fighting for this and wrangling in the revel level of theory and strategy to try to figure out how to actually fight through all the way and win. And it is on that basis that I have come to the conclusions that I have come to that a revolution is needed, what kind of revolution it is, what it needs to aim for, and how we have to go about that. And I am not going to back off of that. That was Bob Avakian speaking at Riverside Church in New York City in a dialogue with Cornell West on revolution and religion in 2014. His conviction, forthrightness, the statement of purpose and mission founded on decades of work on how all forms of exploitation and oppression could really be ended, tells you about the leadership we have to make revolution. It is what we bring in every episode of the RNL Revolution Nothing Less show. And in the second segment of today's program, we're going to play the rest of this part of Bob Avakian's talk at Riverside Church. Bob Avakian BA has further developed and qualitatively enriched the scientific method and approach as applied to society and to revolution and to communism. Communism, like revolution, is a scare word that the rulers of this capitalist system we live under don't want you to know about. Just like they really don't want you to know, and they really don't want the masses of people to know, about how their system really works, how it fuels all the horrors that we face today. No, better to keep you ignorant, both of the way their capitalist system viciously sets people and countries against each other, in the very way it functions and is maintained and brutally enforced by those who rule. And they surely don't want you and the masses of people to know that there is a way out of this madness through a real revolution that could bring about a whole radically different and better way that humanity could be living. And this is what we bring in different ways in every segment and every episode of the RNL Revolution Nothing Less show. Revolution is a serious thing. And as I have said before, not making revolution and instead, letting this system and those who rule it drag humanity into deeper and a more and more horrific hell, if not extinction through their system's destruction of the environment and their drive towards cataclysmic wars, is far scarier. But what stands before us, and what we present in every episode, what our purpose is with this, the most radical and revolutionary program there is anywhere, is not a less scary alternative future, but the liberating road forward to the emancipation of all humanity all over the world to create a radically new kind of society where people really could be fit caretakers of the earth. We have four provocative and important segments today that I want to get into. But first, when you watch, understand that you are going to be taken out of your comfort zone. We're not sugarcoating the present reality. We are not pandering to your prejudices and to what is popular. We are coming at you and bringing to you the true reality of the problem we face in the system we live under and the country we live in, which is the number one exploiter and oppressor, not only in the world today, but in history. We dig down and expose and show the roots and the history of all of this. And like nowhere else, we bring you the solution in the revolution we need 
and the future society that really could be. The vision, the roadmap, the leadership, and the concrete blueprint for the new society. For this to be real requires impacting lots and lots of people now with this revolution and with this show. For this to be real requires engaging, struggling with, and organizing hundreds of organizers and thousands of people into the revolution now in the next months and year and then growing to millions. For this to happen, people need to stop thinking in the system's ways. This show, along with our website, Revcom.us, are the vehicles for doing this. This requires you. This means watching this show and discussing it with others, measuring what we bring to you up against what you were thinking before, and which analysis, which solution, corresponds to the reality that we actually face. I want to appreciate the discussion groups that have met and discussed our previous shows. This afternoon I read a letter sent to us of a discussion of people from four cities on the East Coast, ranging from the South to New England, and they began their uh, discussion by digging into questions that I pose at the end of each episode, and then they rewatch part of the show. They took up one person's serious and important questions, including their differences with some of what we put forward on the RNL show, and then they dug into it. And they concluded their letter with how this person and the others appreciated how our critique of wokeness is coming from a completely different place than the racist critique of the fascists when they attack wokeness for the purpose of erasing the true history of black people and this country. And yet there is so much more in this question and the whole episode for them to return to and dig into. And when you do this with others and begin to understand how this system gives rise to all that torments people today and that it is unnecessary because there is a whole other way society could be organized, that opens up the road to get with the revolution to emancipate humanity. This wrangling, this discussion, this digging into the show is part of preparing and organizing for revolution. It is forging unity through ideological struggle. And at the same time, we need to spread this show, putting up posters and sharing the show over social media. And you need to be a part of that. You need to take that up. Look, there is a huge gap between the quality and content of the RNL show and the size of its audience. A gap that really has to be closed if we are to have the chance to do what is most critical in this period, which is bringing forward a revolutionary people in their millions. It's not enough to watch this show and to like it. It is not enough to watch it with others, even if you dig into the show and wrangle over it, as the people in the letter I just read did. There is an urgent need for us to exponentially expand our audience if we are to make real what this show is calling for in the compressed time frame that we have to do it. So send a message right now to friends. Tell them to watch the show. Don't get distracted from what we're saying, but send that message right now to join you in watching the show. And then follow up on social media and everywhere you can so that soon thousands are watching the show every week, discussing, struggling, and seeing that another world is possible and that that world comes to you every week on the RNL Revolution Nothing Less show.